up everybody back with a new pickup video small amount of shit want to start pumping more videos out and instead of having like three weeks worth of shit piled up this is basically a weekend worth of crap got a nice little amount of shit so we're gonna show it so let's get started uh me and scott's watch went out garage selling before we went back out on tour so got a few things there this is probably like the cool thing from that little venture it's a Spider-Man football jersey from 2001. I actually <laughs> like that the back has Spider-Man. I'm assuming 62 is for like the comic year that he came out. I don't know. What year? I think so. I'm assuming so. But that's cool. So, and it's a 2XL, so it actually fits my fat eye. Uh, what else we got? Picked up these strategy guides for 50 cents a piece. Yu-Gi-Oh! The Sacred Curds. And Pokemon Official Nintendo Player's Guide. It's only missing a few stickers, which is cute. If I can find the stickers. There we go. Like, maybe like ten stickers are missing. So, not bad. What else? And I also got a couple Blu-rays. Uh, Barry Gordy's Last Dragon. I have yet to watch that. And, like, that's the main reason I picked it up. Cause I, I saw it back it. in the 80s. And... I didn't know Barry Gordy made a movie. I don't really want to watch it again. <laughs> and uh, Mockingjay Part 2 on 4K. Why? It's like $10, $15. No. It was $2. Oh, so. okay. It can make a little bit of money. Uh, and then on our way home, there was a garage sale in our neighborhood. Lady had like fucking the methiest mouth I've ever seen. Meth mouth. And it's like a bunch of video game soundtrack CDs. Florida is fucking horrible. Absolutely horrible. A uh, lady wanted two bucks a piece. Should have fucking asked her to see her tits too yeah. while you're at it. She was disgusting. No, well, I'm sure she would have whipped them out. All right, we got piano collection, Kingdom Hearts, still sealed. We got Beauty and the Beast television series, Ron Perlman, which. What was that, Roman numeral? I don't know. What do we say? Six. There we go. Final Fantasy Six. You fucking learned that shit in school? I don't remember them teaching us Roman numerals. Oh, God. That's the piano collection for that. And I also don't play Final Fantasy, so I don't really care. Transformers the movie soundtrack on CD. I don't know what the fuck this is. I just grabbed it because it's Still sealed. sealed. Tony Davis River Wolf. I don't even think it's like gaming related. I just grabbed it. I think this is like a metal band. Lunatica Atlantis? No idea. What is this? Chrono Trigger, original soundtrack. Piano Collection for Final Fantasy IX. Is it 10? Nine. Nine. Yeah. X is 10. Whatever. And, and I before. Whatever. It is. Nobody cares. I don't give a fuck. I really yeah. don't. I know. A uh, never ending story soundtrack. Sealed! <sighs> Final Fantasy Tactics soundtrack. What kind of a fucking nerd do you gotta be to buy soundtracks <laughs> to fucking video games? Like, uh, I don't buy, get it. I get like the Mario soundtrack because that's like catchy. Koopa Troopa just Beach. N64. Just put it on. What is this? Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles Echoes of Time original soundtrack. Six. Final Fantasy Six. See, I'm useful in some ways. Yeah. Uh, this is Castlevania, the PS1 one. I forget what it's called. It's in like Japanese, so. And then this one this is Guild Wars 2, original soundtrack, and it's signed by the dude. Ooh. I looked this up on eBay. There's some crazy guy that wants 300 and one sold for 140. So, this was the gem, and this is like the one that I could give a fuck about. I just grabbed it because it was a video game. Then I got this Ray Earth uh, anime. And I gotta work for a living. <laughs> That's fine. <sighs> Put those back in the box. Really don't have a whole lot to show you. No, there isn't a lot. This is gonna be a small. Peckers. Uh, Dad found two things in the garbage today, and I think I have the case for this that he found that the other I found week. two weeks ago. 
So we got Ed and Eddie, The Misadventures on Xbox. Loose disc, and the disc ain't that bad. No. It should work. And then Shrek 2, the classic. Xbox. There was a pile of them. <laughs> I just, uh... All right. How much? You bring those fucking discs home, and then, you know, if you don't have the case, nobody buys them. I'm separating these by flea market. Alright, so, went to Wagon Wheel Sunday. Why? To find stuff? Why Wagon else? Wheel sucks. They all suck. And they're, it's going to eventually close, just like everybody else. Stop Every it. other fucking flea market's closing out there. Alright, so, for five bucks each, I got these two albums. Funkadelic, One Nation Under a Groove. Put in a nice protective baggie, because it's going in the collection. It's still, like, somewhat sealed, and it's got it's got the hype sticker still on it, so that was a dope little addition for the collection. Hype sticker? Yeah. Those That's are what they call them. It's hype stickers. This one is Parliament Mothership Connection, also with the hype sticker. This thing's beautiful. I love this cover art. It's fucking awesome. Got the funk, man. Uh, the one dude who I'm assuming probably buys, like, storage units or something, or... Or hits up pawn shops in his area. Picked this up, Kirby. Was it Kirby Star Allies? Thirty-five bucks. Like, I wanted it for the collection, so it's like it's cheaper than what GameStop has it for. Pre-owned. Man, we didn't get shit out fucking no, wagon wheel, did we? Shit. No, like it's because like the records yeah. made me happy. This is five bucks for a little baggy. Uh, these are from Denny's from '92. It's got to be for the fucking movie. But it doesn't say the movie anywhere. Yeah. These little Jetsons coloring books. This They're one's got Rosie sealed. on it. You got Judy, Astral, and Elroy. His boy, Elroy. Did you look him up? I, I couldn't. Like, I found like one that has George on it. Oh. That's only one's five bucks now. Mm. Uh. Alright. And then. Because we got finished early at fucking Wagon Wheel and Oldsmar's on the way home. So we hit that up. That place is like a fucking complete ghost town now. It's not a ghost I town, I guess somebody but, took it over. Yeah. And I don't know what the fuck they're doing. I have no clue what they're doing there. But half of the booths are empty. They started dozing some of the shit the outside down. Sheds. The outside sheds. Are, they ripped them down. And then the next set of sheds, there's about 20, 25 sheds. Three of them are occupied, so they're probably going to wait for that other person to get the hell out of there. And then doze those over, yeah. too. It's great because you get there like 9 a.m. and like nobody's even nobody's like there. there with their booths open. Even though it says like 8 a.m. it opens. So. Yeah. This fucker's lazy. Uh, yeah, just start with fucking records. Uh, there's one booth, like, all the way, once we almost, like, finish with the fucking place. They had a bunch of fucking sleeves for 45s. So, nice. Yeah. So Collection. They're all buck a piece, so I picked up a couple. We got Bill Murray Scrooged, and the single is Put a Little Love in Your Heart, with the reverse being Great Big Piece of Love. I've actually never seen this before. It's fucking awesome seeing a sleeve for that. I love that, how simple it is. We got Michael McDonald theme from Running Scared, Sweet Freedom. This is one of my favorite Billy Crystal movies. Is, is it Gregory Hines? Yeah. Yeah. Amazing movie. I fucking love this movie. They should have done more movies together. They really should have. Yeah. When did he die? Like 2000, I think, Hines? Yeah. I don't know. We got Buster Bo yeah. <laughs> Buster Poindexter and his Banshees of Blues. Hot, hot, hot. Yeah. That's David Johansson from the New York Dolls. Okay. Why I know his real name? I don't know. When's he gonna make a comeback? I feel like Buster Poindexter is due to make a comeback. Super Bowl 2021. He's gonna lead it off. <laughs> Better than fucking J-Lo. And then, this one I was excited to get. Tears for Fears, Head Over Heels. Mmm, look at that. What's the other side? One in Love with a Blind Man. I Never love these. Yeah, because it's not on any of the fucking albums. The B-side. And then checked out this one lady's booth. 
Got some pins. Uh, got an enamel pin of Trix the Rabbit. <laughs> Silly Rabbit Trix or for kids. It said or instead of R. Oh, who gives a fuck? And then we got Rogan Gambit. I thought this was like a knockoff. It's actually stamped on the back like 96 Marvel. What, like, doesn't that look like knockoff to you? Like, that looks like shit. Yeah, it does. <laughs> it's actually stamped Marvel. Hmm. And also got this California Raisins button. Tad to all the buttons I have. I got to show these shit. Because I'm a fucking moron. We got Joe Jackson. Stepping out. Hype sticker. And it's in also better condition than the one I already had. So, picked it up. It's two bucks off the same people that I got the fucking uh, 45s. And it's also not for sale copy. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Ooh. And now I own two of these. This one is the cool fold-out version, but it's also missing the same fucking album, because it's a double. I did not know that. Silly me. Fucking Isaac Hayes, Black Moses. I was going to hang this on the bedroom door, but it wouldn't fucking fit. Because he's too big. That's fuck. That's Chef, man. Look at the back, though. The, the back I could fit on the wall. Yeah. Look at him. Look at Isaac... Wearing that gold fucking chain. Mmm. Delicious. Badass. Hello there, children. Oh, I don't know if I could say that. It comes off well, bad. you're imitating. Yeah. Imitating chef. <laughs> Who cares? I don't care. So Alright. It's only 500 views on a fucking video, so who cares? Yeah. Alright, so back to the main portion of the video. See. Uh... That's it. Been slowly organizing. I gotta reorganize this because like that's filled and that one on top, so I gotta scoot everything over and down a layer. We're gonna set up at the wagon wheel this weekend and for the next four weeks. All of February. Yeah. I don't know when this video's going up, so oh, yeah. that that information might be useless to you. Uh I don't know. I really don't know what to say now. I guess thanks for watching. Work still sucks. Go check out Papa Pete, the old guy gamer. I'll leave a link to his shit at the end. Or at this segment right now that's happening with us discussing shit. He'll, I'll put a little icon for him over here. He's Connor's father. But he's cool. And he talks about the Intellivision and shit. He's good people. He's giving me free beers. He's one of my favorite people. Alright. Anything else? You want to say anything? No, no. No, I'm good. Work's annoying. That guy's still annoying on the back of the truck. Just, uh, just, I'm just, you know. We hate Fuck. everyone. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. We're going to do it live. Alright. Like, comment, subscribe. All that fun shit. Love you.